27, 2020, and boy, do we love that Dow Jones. Oh, yeah, we told you about the technical breakdown because we did. Things that we want to really tell you is that the Dow ended down 222 points. You can look for a bigger downside tomorrow morning, and you will, and you will go lower, and you will, and we have told you that, and we have, and the earnings season is halfway over, and stocks have been getting killed. The ones that have popped, drop like rocks. Let Microsoft be an example. Look for lower prices in the Dow Jones. The bear move is not over. We'll let you know when it's over. Oh, yeah, we will. And when we do, it'll be probably shortly after the election. Is it possible now that we will gap down in the morning? And we will. And we are going to get to a point where we will have a bottom. And we're going to gap down. And one of the things I'm going to do to all of my friends that have known us for the last 20 years. Here's the monthly. We talked about the dark cloud. And then we talk about this month of October being lower than the month of selling of September. We have not broke. Now, let me tell you, the 10-week moving average is right there at 26249 That will be the ultimate support level. Because we have not broke. The last time we broke below that was over here. And that was back on 3-2 of 2020. So we haven't had a break below it. That will be our support level on the weekly for the Dow. And you will gap down in the morning a couple hundred points on the Dow. And mark my words, I have not missed it yet. And I have not. If you want to develop the relationship, you want to be able to make a lot of money, you want to be able to change your trade, you want to be able to change everything that you've been doing, which hasn't worked. We've been doing it for 35 years. We know what we're doing. The question is, do you? And do you know how to make money when the markets fall? We'll have you on that side. It pays big. And the scary thing for the Dow at the moment, even though that, that we have that support there on the monthly uh, chart, if we go into another monthly sell signal, which is very close, then, you know, then I'll be changing what I have to say. Right now, what I am going to do is test what we call a 20-week moving average on the weekly. If we go below it, then we have a 50-week moving average down here on the weekly. We're going to see tomorrow that the Dow is going to gap down below that 20-week. Tomorrow's not even here. And I'm telling you what's going to happen. Do you want to make money? Do you want to develop the right relationship? We've called the analysis perfect during the earnings season. They've been doing what? Dropping like rocks. They've been reporting great quarters, but dropping like rocks. Rocks as they drop. S&P is going lower. NASDAQ 100 is going lower. Small cap is going lower in the morning. Look for a gap down in all of the exchanges and mark my words. Mark them.